Well, obviously, as you can tell, we had a slight weather pattern change. It was kind of weird going from hunting in a t-shirt the night before to this. On our way up the hill, uh, we ran into a shadow and I knew right away it was an elk. So we sat there for 15 minutes in the dark and waited till it got a little lighter. And we watched these cows. Um, it was still technically the tail end of the rut and I heard bugling the night before. So I just decided to sit and watch these cows and hope that a bull was gonna show up. fog kept coming in and out and at one point we actually had a couple cows less than 30 yards away which was pretty neat we sat on these cows for I don't know a good half hour or so and uh, just kept waiting for a bull to show up never showed up and daylight was burning so I let these cows bust me and uh, so I could keep on hunting it was fun watching them while I did though well, that was a little fun encounter we uh coming up the hill and I looked over and it was still pretty dark and saw a shape so I checked it out with my binox and we were only like 60 70 yards away from it at that point anyway it turned out to be 12 cows there 10 cows and two cows whatever and uh, hoping there was gonna be a bull there but no bull, which means the rut is probably over. Actually, it is over. And as you can see, we're in snow now. Dramatic change in weather. We went from sunny, super hot, 70 degrees, hunted in t-shirts to snow. No in between. Anyway, that was a fun experience. Go find another one. The higher up we went, the less tracks we saw, but I knew there had to be a bull around here somewhere.
we went up high after seeing those cows and we've gone around this whole basin. We probably put in four to five miles around this basin up high. There's not a single out track up here. We're in like five to six inches of snow. Two days ago, it was 70 degrees. Nuts. So, we're working our way around this basin, start our way back down. Hopefully, start seeing some track. Maybe start seeing some elk. But we only got about 100 yards of visibility as it is. So it's tough going. But we have seen elk this morning, so it's always fun to see them. There's no bull. We're on a little mountain lake here, crossing. After hiking about six miles, we uh, decided to go lower to try to get out of the fog. Well, that didn't work. The fog was basically everywhere. So we spent the rest of that evening just driving some roads, trying to see if we can cut some fresh track. And uh, that didn't work. So time to regroup and make another plan. On to the next day.